Hello everyone. I am Professor Amit Vyas, Computer IT Department from Dr. Supas Technical Campus. Today, we are discuss about the subject of analysis and design of algorithm. And in this subject, the unit of dynamic programming. And the topic is binomial coefficient for the dynamic program. Now, first of all, we saw that what is the binomial coefficient? The computing the binomial coefficient is it difficult to apply the dynamic program. And the condition of binomial coefficient is t of nk equal to t of n minus 1 comma k minus 1 plus c of n minus 1 comma k and we can apply c of n0 equal to 1 c of n n equal to 1 it means this is the condition c of n k equal to c of n minus 1 comma k minus 1 plus c of n minus 1 comma k and c of n0 equal to 1 and c of n n equal to 1 it means what is the n0 n0 it means 10 20 30 40 all the value you can put 1 and c of n n it means 2 2 3 3 4 4 or any number 1 1 you can put 1 so you can write here also if the value is C of 1 0 equal to you can put also 1 and uh, if C of 3 3 or any value number you can put 1 so this is the condition of binomial coefficient now we can show that the example of binomial coefficient. So this is the example. The value is c of 4 2 using dynamic program and solve this problem of binomial coefficient. So first step, uh, you can write the condition. So what is the condition? This is the condition. We can copy that and put here. So this is the condition of binomial coefficient and uh, c of uh, n0 equal to 1 and c of nn equal to 1. Now also we can write c of 4 2 for the given the value. So you can find here the value of n and k. So now n equal to 4 and k equal to 2 this value you can find n and k for the based on the definition now uh, the next is we can start this is the condition you can write and you can find here n and k now you can put value for any operation for binomial coefficient so we can start so you can first of all you can write here c of n k then uh, you can put uh, c of 4 2 so c of 4 2 equal to c of 4 for n equal to 4 you can put here 4 minus 1 comma k k equal to 2 2 minus 1 plus c of n minus 1 it means 4 minus 1 comma k k equal to 2 so this is the basic step you can write here first of all you can put the equation then after if you n and k it means you can give on the example of c of 4 2 then c as it is n minus 1 for n equal to 4 you can find here is first value is n and second value is k so 4 minus 1 then after k minus 1 k equal to 2 so 2 minus 1 plus c of n minus 1 so this is the both are same value 
here you can show that 10k as it is so this is the basic step you can write then after you can find you can write here also just copy paste 10 equal to c of uh, the value is 3 and 2 1 sorry 3 and 1 plus c of 3 comma 2 so you can show that here this value you can find one value for the binomial coefficient and this find also one binomial coefficient so you can check that here c of 3 1 it means you can one condition is apply of binomial coefficient also because of this c of 3 1 is c of n k so c of 3 1 so you can write one value here and you can find one value of c of 3 2 so first of all what is c of 3 1 so c of 3 1 and you can apply also c of n k condition for the binomial coefficient so here c of 3 1 you can apply binomial coefficient and c of 3 2 you can apply the binomial coefficient so first of all we can apply c of 3 1 for the binomial coefficient the condition is this so you can write also this is the c of 3 1 you can find here and this condition so now c of 3 1 equal to you can find n n equal to 3 and you can write here k k equal to 1 so the condition is nk you can apply also c of 3 1 now the next is you can put the value of c of 3 1 so what is the condition you can write here also this is the condition then you can c of 3 1 you can find here if you find c of 3 1 then c of k minus 1 so you can put value uh, value of n and 3 3 minus 1 here comma k minus 1 2 minus sorry 1 minus 1 here you can show that this is the uh, c of 3 1 you can find here also so k minus 1 it means 1 minus 1 then plus c of n minus 1 3 minus 1 comma k k equal to 1 so now next is you can find c of 3 1 then the value is c of 2 comma 0 plus c of 2 comma 1 so you can show that what is the condition here we can find the c of 2 comma 0 it means c of n 0 you can check that here also condition condition is c of n 0 equal to 1 and c of n n equal to 1 it means 1 0 2 0 3 0 4 0 all the value is 1 and uh, we can show that also 1 1 2 1 3 1 all the value is 1 so just we can put if you find a c of 2 0 then put the value of 1 so now next is c of 3 1 equal to 2 0 it means 1 plus c of 2 1 so now you can find the 2 1 value so now find c of 2 1 value so just you can find same process of the 2 1 so we can find that uh, 2 1 value so next is you can show that uh, we can find 2 1 value now the next uh, you can find 2 1 so c of 2 1 here then uh, you can add the condition here so this is the condition just you can copy and paste if you have any problem 
then uh, you can also here we can find that uh, n equal to 2 and k equal to 1 so now next is c of n k you can apply so c of 2 1 value equal to c of n minus 1 it means 2 minus 1 comma 1 minus 1 plus c of 2 minus 1 just put the value and 1 we can put here we can show that uh, c of n k it means uh, n equal to 2 and k equal to 1 we can put this value n and k for this binomial coefficient condition c of 2 1 and c of n minus 1 it means uh, you can show that this 2 and 1 k minus 1 then c of n minus 1 k now you can find c of 2 1 for c of 1 comma 0 plus c of 1 comma 1 now you can show that so what is the value of c of 2 1 c of 2 1 equal to what is the 1 0 you can know that we can put here also condition c of 1 0 1 2 0 3 0 all the value is 1 plus so you can put 1 and plus c of 1 1 is 1 also you can check here c of uh, 3 3 you can put 1 it means uh, 1 1 2 1 because the condition is c of n n so all the value of n n if both are value is same then you can put the value of 1 so now you can put is here 1 also so now next is so you can find the value of finally c of 2 1 so c of 2 1 value is 2 so uh, this is your first uh, equation also you can find that c of 2 1 now you can put is uh, value is here also so this is you can say that uh, here one condition this is one equation you can find that now you can find here c of uh, 2 1 so just you can put here value c of 2 1 we can find c of 2 1 so this uh, c of 2 1 value is 2 just you can put here also so now uh, you can find c of 3 1 for 3 1 is 1 plus c of 2 1 is 2 now just uh, you can put the value of uh, c of 3 1 now the c of 3 1 value is here c of 3 1 equal to 1 plus 1 3 so you can find c of 3 1 final the c of 3 1 you can put here also you can find first condition but we can write here c of 3 1 equal to 3 now you can find one value c of 3 1 but the next is you can also c of 3 2 here also so we can find just c of 3 1 now you can find c of 3 2 so you can just copy c of 3 2 and paste so here we can show the condition also right So this is the condition now you can find a c of 3 2 so just put c of 3 2 here here uh, the n equal to 3 and k equal to 2 so now the condition you can write uh, c of 3 2 put the value for the condition equal to c of 3 minus 1 comma k minus 1 so 2 minus 1 plus c of you can write 2 minus 1 sorry 3 minus 1 comma 2 
so this is the step uh, you can find and continue for example you can find the value c of t2 equal to c of 2 comma 1 plus c of 2 comma 2 so you can find here c of 2 1 plus c of uh, 2 2 now you can put uh, c of 3 2 for the value is c of 2 1 value you can find here also 2 1 plus you can find c of 2 2 what is the c of 2 2 it means the condition is c of n n equal to 1 it means 1 1 2 2 all the value is 1 so you can put just 1 here now you can find a c of 2 1 so just now you can find c of 2 1 so c of 2 1 you can just find that time uh, you can find here also n n equal to 2 and k equal to 1 so this is the condition so uh, directly we can put the value is here so c of 2 1 equal to c of or uh, n minus 1 it means 2 minus 1 comma k minus 1 1 minus 1 plus c of you can put here n minus 1 comma k it means n minus 1 2 minus 1 comma k k value is 1 so this is the condition you can write here so c of 2 1 so what is the c of 2 1 equal to c of 2 minus 1 is 1 comma 1 minus 1 is 0 so just you can addition and subtraction also now the condition is c of 2 comma 1 then you can put here what is the c of 1 0 if you find the 1 0 then it is a value is 1 and c of 1 1 is also 1 so now you can find c of 2 1 equal to 2 so just uh, you can check that you can find c of 2 1 so here we can find c of 2 1 also so now you can find c of 2 1 so you can put here value is so c of 3 2 equal to 2 1 is 2 so 2 plus 1 equal to 3 so now c of 3 2 equal to 3 and c of 3 1 equal to 3 so just we can put here this is the value is for the c of uh, 3 1 and 3 2 so just put here also now c of 4 2 equal to you can find uh, 3 1 and 3 2 so you can find 3 1 3 1 equal to 3 and 3 2 equal to 3 so you can just put here 3 plus 3 now c of 4 2 equal to 6 now this is the final answer of a binomial coefficient now first of all you can check that here so this is the topic of binomial coefficient in dynamic programming now uh, this is the condition the condition is the importance uh, c of n k equal to c of n minus 1 comma k minus 1 plus c of n minus 1 comma k and uh, c of n 0 equal to 1 and c of n n equal to 1 now we can say that if c of n 0 it means uh, c of 1 1 uh, sorry c of uh, 1 0 2 0 3 0 4 0 all the value are you can put is 1 and then second is a uh, c of n n 
means you of uh, 1 1 2 2 3 3 all the value you can put here 1 you can show that here also 1 0 equal to and all the condition you can this one now the example is you can find a c of 4 2 using dynamic programming or binomial coefficient this is the example now you can put the condition here so you can find a c of 4 2 for n and k so n equal to just put n equal to 4 and k equal to 2 so now you can start c of n k so n equal to 4 and k equal to 2 so condition is c of n minus 1 comma k minus 1 plus c of n minus 1 comma k then you can put c of n minus 1 it means 4 minus 1 then k minus 1 2 minus 1 plus c of n minus 1 4 minus 1 then k now you can find c of this value you can find c of 3 1 and plus this value you can find c of 3 2 then after you can directly next you can apply binomial coefficient for c of 3 1 also then you can find also this value c of 3 2 for the binomial coefficient and finally c of 3 1 and 3 2 you can find and the answer is finally c of 4 2 so you can apply c of 3 1 for the binomial coefficient and n equal to 3 and k equal to 1 then you can find the value of uh, c of 3 1 so c of 3 1 you can find here is 3 and uh, this is also you can find c of uh, 2 1 so it is required then you can find c of 3 2 so you can find c of 3 2 value also so this is the uh, c of 3 2 value and uh, finally you can add c of 3 1 and 3 2 for the binomial coefficient so you can add c of 4 2 equal to 6 so this is the final answer of the c of 4 2 so thank you all of you